I'm just going to be quickly going through the plans for my Mark II MX-5. Before I go through the plans for this MX-5, I'm just going to quickly go through what I've done to the car so far. So, when I got the car at the beginning, the first thing I done was install coilovers. They were just eBay coilovers. You can see it is sitting just at a reasonable height, it's not too low. Uh, gets over speed bumps, so that's okay for me. Uh, after that, I put an uh, aftermarket exhaust, cat-back exhaust on it. So it basically goes halfway back through the car. You can see that at the end there's some classic shit melted on it. It's a stainless steel tip and the rest isn't stainless steel so it's a little bit rusty. Um, and then my first two videos I have up on my channel, I plasti dipped it and I installed a tablet and set off the existing, to replace the existing uh, head unit. Uh, that's basically all I've done to it, is kind of upgraded speakers, a few bits on the inside, small bits. So the only two main things were the exhaust and coilovers. I actually had new wheels fitted on as well. I picked these up second hand. They are some uh, BCW wheels. I didn't really know much about them before I got them. I don't know if they're real, fake. Um, so I basically picked up these wheels. They were about 400 euro. They came with the tires. They were basically brand new on them. It was a pretty good deal, but after about six months, they started cracking on the inside of the back. So pretty bad on the back. And that's why I took them off and just threw on the, um, the wheels I got with the car. Um, so that's why I've had on it the past like two or three weeks. Um, so one of the first things that's coming for this car now is a new set of wheels. So I'll have them going on reasonably soon. Okay, so what is coming new for this car? The first thing I'm doing is I am plasti dipping it again. Have you seen the previous video? I plasti dipped this midnight red. It was like a black base coat and then kind of a clear coat with pigment in it. It worked out kind of okay, but once I got the color I liked, I basically stopped and didn't put enough plasti dip on it. And then I had an accident on this side of the door where I got a cut in a gate. So this door is going to be replaced anyway, but I tried to peel off some of the plasti dip and it just is not coming off in like uh, sheets. So I got some WD-40 sprayed on the door and it makes it a lot softer. So I think I'm going to spray the whole car with a lot of WD-40 and try get a really strong power hose and take it off. The new colour that I'm doing is uh, 50, it's called 50s Aqua, it's like a really light uh, blue. I'm going to be doing a white base coat and putting on it a lot thicker so that it kind of wears a bit better. Some parts um, on the car, like there, you can see just tiny little spots um, have been kind of wearing over time. So hopefully it'll be a lot more durable when it's a bit thicker. Um, then after that, obviously the wheels, I'm putting on new wheels to replace these ones. I haven't picked what tires I'm getting yet, just because these are cracked and they're all curbed up from me not driving properly. And then the rear wheels obviously don't match the front, so that's another reason why I'm going to be swapping them out. So new colour, new wheels. Another thing I want to pick up is some sort of uh, head, some sort of light, fog light to go in these little holes here. The MX-5s can do usually come with uh, fog lights, but it's an after, it's an option, and obviously this person didn't choose it. This one basically came with covers that used to fit in here, but after taking them out. So the two things that are going to get done to the car first are new wheels and tires, and the car's going to be plasti dip blue. Um, after that, in probably about probably like kind of late December in the new year I've after ordering uh, some body pieces to the, for the car from uh, True, MC, True MCG from Maxton Design they do some body pieces so for this car I've after picking up a uh, front splitter that will just go on this bumper uh, just on the front and then I've after picking up some side skirts um, I ordered a flush panel as well for the lifted MX-5 if anyone's seen that uh, that build just to basically get rid of the keyhole as I don't uh, have a key for the boot anymore I put um, flush bonnet pins on the boot so for the outside of the car that's going to be it just the paint wheels and the front lip side skirts and then probably before the side skirts and the front lip go on I want to build something for the inside here some sort of speaker to sit up here that is it for this video it's only a short video going through some of the plans I have for this car I'm really excited to uh, definitely to plastic dip the car and have it look in a completely different color as the color is at the moment is fairly similar to what it was before it was kind of a bluey sort of color the new wheels are going to look really 
really good on the car as well. I have them, I got them about two weeks ago. I'm just waiting on spigot rings and I'm gonna get tires as well. The car hasn't been really been taken care of the last two months. Um, I was doing delivery driving in this car, so I was doing a lot of mileage. I didn't have really time to kind of fix it up and do sort of things to it, as I was driving it so often and needed it for work. So it's gonna be good over the next kind of month, being able to do a lot of work on this car and having, look, having it look good again. If you want to follow this and see the plastic dip and wheels, everything been done to this car, be sure to subscribe and like the video. See you in the next one.